today i'm going to explaining about how to install the mq version 7 on windows 7 os before install the mq version 7 we need to install the eclipse platform version 3.3 or later version now i'm going to the project software dump and under this one prerequisites the folder under the ies we have the setup file is the exe files just double click on this exe file click on ok now it is going to installing the websphere eclipse platform version 3.3 click on next accept the terms and conditions click on next if you want to change the destination folder you can change otherwise just leave them by default location and click on next click on install now it is going to installing the Webspear studio ies version 3.3 and this is the wizard that will show the status of the installation Click on finish. We had installed the IBM Webspace Eclipse platform. Now we are going to install the MQ version 7. Go to the software dump, go to the folder and double click on the setup file. Click on run. Click on Webspace MQ installation and click on launch IBM Webspear MQ installer now it is going to open the wizard here we are installing the MQ version 7.0 accept the terms and conditions click on next here we have three options first one is in typical second one is in compact third one is in custom coming to the typical if you select this typical type it is going to install the all the common features which are recommended for the new users if you select compact it is going to install the minimum features need to run Webspear MQ if you select custom you need to 
manually select the whatever the components you need to install in the machine here we are going to leave the whatever the default type is called a typical click on next is going to show the where is the folder is going to install click on install now is going to installing the software it will take some time Now click on finish. Click on next. It is going to check for the networks. But here I am installing the standalone machine. Here we don't have any network configurations. Now here are any of the domain controllers in your networking running Windows 2 or later here we don't have any domain controllers that is the reason we need to select no and click on next. So click on next. Click on next. Uncheck the notepad and by default leave the website MQ Explorer because click on finish. After that, it is going to open the MQ Explorer screen. See, this is the original screen which we are going to working on our production servers on uh, the environment discord next series I am next video I am going to explain about uh, how to create the queue managers what are the queues channels listeners etc so if you have any queries please mail me your queries my mail id is wmqmb training2012 at gmail.com